Hey guys, this is Bloody Biscuits, and we are here in, I think, Canalave City, and we're just about to battle our rival for the fifth time, I think. I missed the fourth battle because I for I didn't even know that they switched it to be right in front of the Pastoria Gym. So, uh, yeah, that's why I missed it. Hopefully it's not that big of a deal. It wasn't really that hard of a battle, anyway. Okay, so I'm going to show you my team. <clears throat> I have Raikabu, my Raichu up front at level 42. Um, Nose Thunderbolt, Grass Knot, Return, and Nasty Plot. And then we have Infernape, who knows, Flame Wheel, Close Combat, Flamethrower, and Mock Punch. We have Hip Hop, our Hip Hout on. He, he has Rock Tomb, Crunch, Yawn, and Earthquake. Then we have Donald, our Golduck, who has Surf, Psych Up, Confusion, and Focus Blast. And I think finally we have Strike, who um, has X Scizor, Steel Wing, Wing Attack, and Agility. And then we have our HM Slave. Okay, so yeah, let's go. It, it's the same exact spot as it was in Diamond and Pearl, but it is a very different battle. They've actually toughened it up just a little bit. Alright, so you go onto the bridge, and there he is. I'm going to the. Yes, I'm going to challenge the gym leader. Someone should check to see if you're really for. I've beaten you four times before, dude. I don't think I need a checkup. That's someone as me with my brand new gym badge. Oh, just because you think you have one more gym badge than me thinks you're so better. So there goes the epic berry dance again, or Ambulu dance. God, it's like second nature to me. <coughs> Okay, so this is going to be my strategy. What I'm going to do is set up Nasty Plot and then practically sweep his team. Seriously, I think that's all I need to do. Because Raikapu has practically... I think it was his special attack and uh, speed are like at 100 each, so... Yeah, this will definitely kill it. A T-Bolt, it's electric type, it's going to hurt. Even with the nasty plot, there's so many things I could factor in. This guy's going to die. Let me just say that. He's going to die. And now we're getting a bunch of chunks of experience, which is great. I'm enjoying that. Alright, um, next up is Rapidash. Um, yeah, I think it was Ponyta back in Diamond and Pearl. Now, also, that Star Raptor used to be a Star Ravia in Diamond and Pearl. Now it's a Star Raptor. Now, uh, Ponyta is a Rapidash. He practically evolved everybody from Di from Diamond and Pearl in Platinum. He's probably evolved his um, Roselia into a Roserade. He's evolved his Starter, whatever that is, into its final form. And he also has a Heracross, which is also kind of new. Um, I'm gonna keep battling. I'm gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and kill this thing because I'm pretty sure with a Nasty Plot and a Stab Thunderbolt, this thing's going to die. On Blog TV. Um, it survived it just because it was paralyzed, I'm pretty sure. So I'm pretty sure it's going to die now. Yep, no problem there. So yeah, I'm just getting chunks and chunks of experience. And here comes Empoleon. See, it used I'm pretty sure it would have been a print plup in uh, Diamond and Pearl. Now it's evolved into its final form, Empoleon. So it's a little bit more of a challenge. And it's also steel type, which is kind of cool. But of course, Empoleon will be nothing like my Empoleon, ever. Back in Diamond, it'll never be like that. So yeah, I'm just sweeping with Nasty Plot and Thunderbolt, that's pretty much it. And he's going to finish off with his Roserade, which has evolved from his Roselia into a Roserade. I'm going to use Strike here, because... Just because I wanted to get some experience. It's, but it's going to... Evolve into a scissor soon, so yeah, I'm gonna be happy about that. So let's use wing attack, and I'm pretty sure this thing's going to die. I have technician, I have stab, and yeah, a lot of things are going to factor in. This thing's going to die. So yeah, and we get that level up, and that was your rival for the fifth time, either fifth or fourth time. I haven't tell what just happened. You're telling me a lot. I think that's his like his last line, like for every single battle, because he's always surprised. Yeah, yeah, you're just a bit better than me as usual. But I guess who's going to take on the Pokemon League and become the champion? Uh, no, you're not. You're nothing like the rival in the first generation where he actually gets there. And yeah, he hints, hints to you that you should go to Iron Island to train up, and I actually am going to go there later. 
Um, so yeah, that was your rival battle, and yeah, I think that's it for this segment, so I will see you guys next time.